you guys welcome back to my channel i know i'm starting this video at a very weird angle i don't even know if you guys are seeing me but um today is the start of the end i just thought it would be nice for me to vlog and show you guys around what i'm up to today so yeah and people are just looking at me <laughs> i'm sitting in the like in the parking lot and people are just like why are you talking to yourself but anyway I've missed you so much guys it's because <laughs> life has been happening I've been planning a lot of things things have been happening around me a lot of hectic things has been happening but um, I just uh, I beg just know that whenever I disappear guys I'll always reappear <laughs> okay uh, sometimes it's all because things that are out of my control and sometimes my emotions will be like all over the place so I cannot um, take a camera and be like, oh, so how are you guys? Whilst I'm not my best self, my best self emotionally. So that's why I've been away and been quiet. But anyway, so guys, well, <laughs> today I'm just gonna take you guys throughout my day and just show you around what I've been, what I'm up to. It's nothing much, nothing fancy, nothing whatever. I'm just going to take you guys around my day, and I even tried to do the whole laying of edges guys but anyway it's not cute but anyway we tried we tried okay so yeah let me just stop rambling and i'll catch you guys in a much better place where i'll be able to talk and chat and all that for now people are just looking at me weirdly like girl who are you talking to because i'm all by myself in this car Hey, I don't 
Hi you guys. Um good evening. So this is much 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 later in the day. I think it's now it's around um it's around 9 p.m. And if you can hear any background noise, guys, please just bear with me because I'm sitting in my bedroom and there's a toilet in so there's water getting into the toilet tank. So just bear with me. But I just thought maybe I could just take this time to fill you in guys with what has been happening to me. Uh, and just open my heart to you guys, uh, how I've been feeling and all that. So, like I said, I love sharing my my story with people. I love sharing my journey with people because um, I know there's someone out there who is like looking up to to me, and I also want to be an example to someone. I want someone to look at life and say, "If Snehiwe did it, I can did it too." <laughs> I can do it too. So that, that that's just the reason why I share my life story. Uh, I think back then, uh, when I used to, uh, when I was like looking for inspiration, looking for role models, and looking for like good examples of people with disabilities who are living their life fully, I used to search like on TV, on the internet. I think back that back in those days, internet was not even that a thing during those days, and I couldn't find anyone that I could admire and say this person is living their best life. So for me, I want to be that person. I want someone to Google on uh, on Google, <laughs> on YouTube, everywhere, and say, let me Google, I want to find an example. And, the, and my video will be the first one to be like, here I am, honey, to help you. So that's also the reason why I share my story. And I, I get a lot of people who are like, Cindy, why do you share like your personal life with the world, with strangers? What do you open up about sensitive issues on your channel? I don't even know how you do it to to share your personal life with the world. But for me, it's something that I love to do. It's something that I love doing. But anyway, enough of all those um, rambling and all that. Uh, today, I just want to, to talk about like how I've been feeling uh, this past month. So firstly, I just want to say thank you so much, guys, for all your lovely comments and um all your support after i posted a video that i lost my baby you guys have been so supportive you guys have sent me a lot of messages a lot of uh, comforting words a lot of beautiful beautiful messages some of you have even shared uh with me your like personal journeys and i really appreciate that guys and i just want to say thank you so much for all that for sharing your beautiful beautiful life stories some of them the stories they are not really like beautiful they are like really painful stories but at the end of the day you guys are here you guys are kicking you guys are surviving so that's the beauty of uh, your stories and i really appreciate that uh so for me what's been happening <laughs> so I, I i came back on youtube i think after about six months i posted two videos and then i disappeared again it's all because nothing bad had happened honestly but firstly, I just couldn't find the time to take videos and like and do all those stuff because YouTube can be time consuming, honey. Um, I also had other commitments, so I couldn't just um take videos and just post. And also, my emotions were just like all over the place. Today, I'm happy. I'm feeling my best. The following day, I just want to close the curtains and i don't want to face the world the following day i'm just like in between i'm like ah. so my feelings were all over the place um so firstly one thing that i've also been contributing is the fact that i lost my baby i think you, you know what so when i lost the baby i was in those um i was in those um what is it called my emotions were like i want to get pregnant again now so that i can have a baby now that's what i was feeling at the time <laughs> just because i lost the baby whenever i see someone holding like a newborn i used to i don't know like i just used to feel so bad feel so sad and my heart would 
say like it was just so bad guys now i am feeling much better but that time i was like the only thing that can heal me is for me to have another baby is for me to get pregnant again <laughs> but um i thank god that it didn't happen that way because i i needed time to heal i needed time to myself i needed time to process all these emotions and i thank god for my partner who was like no girl we are not going to do that now we need time to rest but for me i was like i'm ready to have a baby now but anyway so that's what i also contributed but i think also another thing is things were just not okay guys like everything was just not okay things were not going according to my plan and I, if i'm to be honest there were times when i was so angry with god there were times when i was just doubting my faith there were times when i was just like god when is it going to end is this ever going to end and i was just i just felt like i wanted to cry there were days when i could just cry myself to bed because things were just not okay things were not going the way i wanted and also i think i'm still also still mourning my brothers if some of you follow me here know that i lost my two brothers last year first born in our family and the second one in a space of two months and it really broke my heart even up to now there's no day that passes without me mentioning my brothers because you know it was a lot and i'm also still processing those emotions and I think now, whenever something nice and something good happens, I'm always like, I wish my brother was here. I wish my brothers were here to witness this. So I think, yeah, that, that's just how I was feeling. I was not my, I was not my best self. There were days when I just woke up, I don't even feel like bathing. I just wanted to be in bed the whole day. I just wanted to cry. I think I even lost a bit of weight. If you, if you know me well, I even lost a bit of weight. So yeah, I think basically that's what's been happening. But I also have some good news, honey. Some good news, baby. <laughs> I thank God for my life. Honestly, I always pray and say, God, please forgive me for all the times when I was not grateful. Because I think God has been so faithful in my life. I don't want to get emotional. But God has been just so good in my life. I remember there were things that I really wished for when I was young. Um, but because as I grew up, because of situations and all that, I was like, I don't think I I, I want to do that anymore. I don't think I will achieve that anymore. But God is like, no, baby, no, honey, whatever you prayed for, I kept that in my records and I'm going to deliver it to you. And I just thank God for that. And I just want to encourage someone here that whenever you pray or whenever you tell God something, just know that you are banking up your prayers. There is a time when God is just going to, you're just going to withdraw your prayers and you're just going to withdraw your blessings. And God will never leave you or forsake you. So always trust in the Lord and always say, God, I'm your child. I don't have any power over my life. I give my life to you. And you are going to help me to achieve whatever that I want to achieve. So, yeah. So, the good news is uh, your girl is getting married. I'm getting married, guys. And I'm really excited about that. And I just hope and pray that everything is going to go well. And you guys are going to see all the videos my traditional wedding my white wedding you are going to see all those videos i'm going to record for you guys and you guys are going to see um i think i also have like official professional videos as well but i just thought it would be nice for me to share this with you guys to say your girl your girl is getting married yeah but i think that's just all um like what i told you that there are days when i just woke up and i'm like oh my god i'm getting married i'm so happy i'm so excited and then there are days where i'm just like life is not going according to my plan and also guys <laughs> my life is a mess um 
so another thing I wish I forgot to mention that the reason why I was not on YouTube is as you guys know, if you're an OG, you know that I record my videos using my phone. And you know what, people? And you know what, honey? And you know what? I broke my phone. I think I didn't have a phone for almost close to two weeks. And I was so stressed. I was hella stressed. Because for me, my phone... What is that? Sorry. So for me, my phone is something that... My work is just based on my phone. Everything. My life evolves around my phone. So for me not to have my phone for two weeks, it's not, um, you know, it was just a stressful moment for me. So that's why I also think I haven't been posting videos because I didn't have a phone for two weeks. And I didn't have anything to record my videos with. But life has been hectic, guys. Although, yes, I have good news, but I think 70%. Life has been a lot. It has been hectic. It's been it has been stressful. A lot of things have been happening. In my family, in my life, Ugh, everything. And I, <laughs> I wanted to share this news with you guys. To I think way be, like way back to just tell you guys that oh, your girl's getting married and all that. But honestly. I was like, what if, if what if things goes doesn't go well, or what if things don't go as as we are planning them to be? I think I need to wait and just I don't know. But I was like, you know what? It's life. Things happen. This is it. I'm just on YouTube to share my journey with you guys. The bad, the good, and the ugly. We are not here to just share the good news only, but. The bad, the good, and the ugly, and you guys, your family. Like, I just wanna give you a hug, guys. Look at how the screen is breaking out. I think it's the masks, and I just don't know what to do. And I need to have good skin for the big day. But anyway, that's a story for another day. And I think I'm also going to insert a clip of me just doing like my nighttime routine, which is not even a lot. I don't even know if I can call it a routine. Because honey, there are not even a lot of products in the like the other night whatever skincare night skincare routine that I see on YouTube. It's a lot. Mine, I don't even know if I can call it a skincare routine because honey. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I think I'm just going to continue with this. Um, what is it called? To continue with this um vlog, and I'll just end it. But for now. Let me just insert my skincare routine. So let's go. 